hello my lovely people welcome back to my channel i greet you according to your time and the time you are seeing this video we are still on the gist from the palace of oni of ife uh, this is celebrating the king oni of ife at 49 so my people today the king of ile ife kingdom oni of ife is 49 years old they said the celebration started properly uh, yesterday night and during that event uh, only three of his wives were present Olori Mariam, Olori Temitokwe and uh, Dr. Elizabeth that they were the ones present in that uh, occasion although we do know that it will continue uh, even after that yesterday to still continue today and henceforth so they said uh, looking at the wives for those who have watched the videos you find out that they are not happy at all you can tell that there is something wrong with them although we do know that the all the girls goes in the palace uh, is enough trouble to change their face and in, in an event like this and uh, they will just come out to make people believe that all is uh, well. well anyway whether they are happy or not they have to come and uh, perform their duty because uh, being by the side of the king at a time like this is one of their uh, duties why the king married them so they are here whether they are happy or not uh, uh, it doesn't matter now but it is better it will be better if they are happy because happiness is the key to everything so and a lot of people have been asking why is it that uh, Ronke, Olori Ronke is not present here? What of uh, Toby? Although we do know that recently uh, Toby doesn't attend occasions like that. And that is why a lot of people have concluded that uh, maybe she is pregnant or, or, or uh, something like that. So, but uh, Ashley, who is also in town, because we do know that they say she arrives uh, some days ago that she is in town right now she is not present here maybe because of the problem they said she have the king where the king cautioned her about getting a gift for prince tadenikawo and all of that that video will come later so but there's this a uh, right up a kind of a birthday wish that the same ashley who did not show up in the event penned down for the king and i was like is that to confuse the public or is it that uh, i don't just let me just share the uh birthday wish with you guys so according to ashley she wrote so this is ashley's birthday uh, message to the king his royal highness queen ashley afola sade happy birthday to the one who fills my days with joy and my heart with love may your day be as bright and beautiful as your smile to my amiable husband at oni adimulaife akande M Ajiwe Fun Osha. Hey, me an office read your bow. So Olori, who makes every day brighter. Your love is the greatest gift. And I'm grateful to share another year of wonderful moments with you. Cheers to a day as special as you are. Mm -hmm. Those of you who understand Yoruba, you can now read it in Yoruba. Mm -hmm. So they said uh, a continuation. Cheers to many more years in good health love laughter and abundance of wealth last oludumare forever yours his royal highness olori ashley afosalade adeyeyi ogunsi ojaja the second yeye omi odua bs yodoma so my people you can see the uh, birthday wish from Olori Ashley who never attended the occasion unless she will still come because like we do know the occasion will continue she did not attend that first day uh, that started yesterday night because no one sees her I did not see her if you see her please let us know on the comment section and I was wondering so she took her time to write all this but showing herself in the event event to tell uh, to make the king to be uh, as happy and brighter as she is writing is a very big deal i don't know what will be the cause but i believe that if truly it is what i'm thinking she just wrote this to confuse the public so guys i don't know what to think please uh, whatever be your opinion 
uh, say it on the comment section. And I was like, what happens to Ronke? Olo the Ronke. We did not see her because me, I did not see her. If you see her, please just show us a clip of uh, this thing because me, I did not see her. Then uh, it's obvious that uh, when Naomi did not come, you know, of course, some uh, somehow I wasn't expecting her to come because if she come, it simply means that uh, everything has been settled. And with that, the king might go and uh, relax and believe that uh, all is well now. You know, as for Prince Tadenika, I don't even need, I don't even think uh, it's important or is necessary that uh, the king, uh, Queen Naomi, should bring him here. No, it is not somehow safe considering the kind of uh, wolves in sheep clothing, as all is in the palace and all of that. So, my people, oh, let's just wish our king a happy birthday my prayer for him is that he is going to live long and god is going to give him wisdom and understanding and open his inner eyes so as to tackle all this uh, spiritual attack from all this uh and infected uh, plants that he gathered here as wise so my people what do you think whatever that you wish the king please pen it down uh below the comment section and i also pray that uh, god will uh, device a means that the king will settle the issue that he is having with these women so as to enable him bring back when Naomi and Prince Tadenikawo back to the palace so that his reign will be very sweet and enjoyable. I'm not saying that he is not enjoying his reign, no, but it will be more uh, fun and more blessed with uh, when Naomi right beside him because let me tell you this birthday that uh, if some everyone is acting up and all of that the moment when Naomi set in in this place now you see that every there will be smiles you know but to some people eh, their their mood will even go deeper <laughs> because they wouldn't want to see her here just if you go and watch the previous uh Big day, party, a big day party of the king where when Naomi was present, you will see that everywhere is filled with happiness and joy. If I can't see praises, there was one I watched, I was like, This woman, eh, hey, you hold the key to this your husband's heart, seriously. And that is why the king is always uh, 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 yearning for Queen Naomi's presence in his life. But all this drama queen will not allow him. But in any case, I believe that God is making a way where we see uh, there seems to be no way. Whether they want to leave the palace or not, God will do, do it in a way that they will be the one begging, please, I want to leave, oh, and all of that. <laughs> because with all these atrocities from them, one day, one day, monkey, go, go, market, you no know, go, return. In all, let's just wish our king a happy birthday because it is his day and he is going to enjoy it. And God is going to add more good health and wisdom to him to be a better king. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you are yet to subscribe. If you are returning subscriber, thank you so much for your support. Bye for now. Love you guys.